In today's video, I'm going to show you what I believe to be the best hot route in Madden NFL 21. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. My YouTube channel is designed, if you've never been here before, to help you improve in Madden. And so if that's something that interests you, what I want to encourage you to do right now is to go down in my description, click join my Discord, there's a link right there for you. And Discord is basically a community platform where I'm able to connect with you, you're able to connect with me, but you're also able to connect with everybody from my YouTube channel. It's a great platform to help you grow and improve in Madden 21. All right, so the best hot route in Madden 21, let's jump right into it. Again, I'm just gonna come out in five wide because it doesn't matter, again, that we're just doing hot routes. So we're just gonna come out out of verticals. Now, a lot of people are running the dime 146 and a lot of people are running cover two man out of it and basically just adjusting their zones accordingly to what you do. And so what I wanna do right now is I wanna show you the best hot route in Madden 21. It's very, very simple. It's the curl route. That's right, the curl route is back this year. Basically against any coverage, it doesn't really matter. As soon as the curl stops, he is gonna be wide open. He's gonna be wide open against man, he's gonna be wide open against zone, he's gonna be wide open against everything. Right, let me show you here, this is, um, whoops, I apologize. We uh, we called the wrong, or we didn't put the curl out there. The curls, curls get open against everything this year. Literally everything that defense runs, a curl will get open. So what I like to do a lot of is I will literally go to all curl. Um, simple curl route concepts on both sides of the field and then I'll just low pass it and you see how I can basically click onto my click onto my receiver and I swerve him essentially to get that inside position right there see how I'm just swerving him right there just to keep him just keep him inside shuffle his feet a little bit to get that stop route um, but stop routes this year is so so good low balling them is really really good one of the things that you don't want to do Listen to me, one of the things you do not want to do, okay? And I make this mistake still because Madden 20, you did want to do this, but don't pass lead these, just throw them. Just low ball them. If you're gonna pass lead them, you can pass lead them against man, but if you try to pass lead these against zone, I've ran into a lot of issues this year. Um, you see there, see how he jumps it? That time I pass led and he jumped the ball. So one of the things you want to do, and of course, you know, you, you can work this a simple curl flop concept that's really all we're going to try to do here but you'll see on the right side um, it's really going to be open you see there I can click on the funches I can make the play curl routes this year are so effective so effective I like curls in the slot I like curls in the outside and I like curls everywhere this year in fact even a baby hitch route um, does do wonders for you this year but these curl routes are so good if you're struggling to beat man to man run a curl route if you're struggling to beat zone run a curl route if you're struggling to beat the blitz, run a curl route. Curl routes, you can put them all over your field and they really do well. Obviously there I throw a pick because I tried to pass lead it, but you can see how effective these curl routes are. Um, they're so good against man-to-man. -man. Like man-to-man, -man, I don't struggle beating man-to-man. -man when I, I lick my chops when I see someone run man-to-man -man on me because I know exactly what I'm gonna do. Now. Right there, Jonathan Jones versus Aaron Jones. You know, a little bit of a mismatch from a route running perspective. But Devontae Adams, literally, there's nothing the defense can do. If I put Aaron Jones on a little hitch, this little all curl concept right here, you see how Jones jumps jumps the route right there, the curl route? I can then check it down to that little hitch. So what I like to do, and again, this is a very simple concept, but the curl hitch concept, literally that's all I'm gonna do. I'm running curl routes and I'm running the hitch route. And one of these guys is going to get open every single time. It doesn't matter the defense. It doesn't matter if it's cover three. It doesn't matter if it's cover four. It doesn't matter if it's cover two. Like These curl routes this year are so good, especially in combination with one another. Because if, let's just say if, you know, they may be running something like this, where they're going to take away Aaron Jones, then what you're going to see is this curl route in behind it is now going to be open right there in a little stop route. This also is a very good pull route. So let me show you uh, the play four verticals from the gun trips. And I might not be able to show it to you out of this specific play, but I'm going to put Devontae Adams on a curl. Let me actually let me actually come out of here real quick. So I've talked about this play a lot this year. Um, it's one of my favorite plays in the entire game. But gun trips and the play is fade stops. And we are just going to come out in dime one four six, 
and we're going to come out in the cover four so we can audible to all the other plays. So basically this is a really good pull route as well against zone coverage. So depending on the zone, if you're facing cover one, you throw a curl out there, watch what happens to the defense. That corner on that side is going to sit right there and then that route is going to be open for a one play touchdown. I broke that down earlier on my channel, right? Some people said, well, it's not good because you're just using the Chiefs. It's good. This is the Packers, right? These are route concepts. Curl routes this year are so effective against everything. So here, here's cover four. Capacity that. Um, whoops. Cover four um, will probably do the best job um, with this specific route combination, especially against the with that over the top. Because you'll see here the see how that corner just sits right there, and then you can you can basically try to fit it in over the top. Curl routes are really good for pulling the, the zones down. So are hitches. So are hitches this year. Um, again, guys, there's just so much you can do. What I like to do from this is turn it, you can turn this into a five wide set right here, just like this right here. Snap of the ball. And again, you're in that same concept. But double curls this year, I love it. Double A curl and a hitch, I love it. Oh, I'm telling you guys, just run curl routes. Trust me on this. You're not going to be disappointed. Here's a curl route concept here. And see how they just sit in the zones and they beat man too because they basically post it up so this is in my opinion the best hot route in Madden 21 it's the best hot route that you can do with your quarterback um, you have it available to you in any formation curls beat man the beat zone and uh, with the proper pass leading and the proper understanding of what the defense is trying to do you can pretty much run curl routes against almost any defense in Madden 21 and have some level of success so wanted to get this out to you um, again I'm not the one that put you know invented the curl route or anything I'm just saying what I've noticed this year playing the game and from what I've seen from other guys playing the game curl routes are really 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 effective so you want to add that to your arsenal if you guys are really looking to take your offense to the next level what I want to encourage you to do right now is to pick up my Madden 21 competitive ebook the ebook is based out of the Arizona Cardinals playbook. It's a spread playbook. I've thrown for over 800 yards in one game one time with this offense. Um, scored over 10 touchdowns, put up 70 plus points with this offense. One of the guys that picked up the guide said it's the best $25 he spent. We have over 70 pages of written breakdowns for you, over 12 hours of video footage, breaking down not only the, the tips and strategies, but also the film study and behind it. So if that's something that encourages you or that interests you, what I want to encourage you to do right now is to go in the description and click on my Madden 21 competitive bundle guide and pick it up. It's really good. It's only $25 one time fee and it updates throughout uh, the entire month of August there for you guys. So anyways, guys, there's going to be some videos that pop up on the screen right now that are going to help you guys get a little bit better at Madden. But I do want to invite you personally invite you to my live stream. I stream every single night at 10 o'clock Eastern time. We'd love to see you there. Be sure to hit subscribe on the channel and we'll see you tonight at 10 o'clock or we'll continue the conversation in one of these other videos.